Alright, so for to begin this project for your cartoon self-portrait of your document the way I have it, um, I've asked you to do that in our class blog, and we need to place your image in there, which we all should have done already together in class. Now it's time to start tracing. This is the kind of product that I'm looking for at the end of it, okay, at the end of your project. Notice your face color and your neck color, there are two different values there. What that does is it creates depth in your image. So it looks like your head is sticking out away from your body. Uh, and there might be a little shadow cast on the neck area of your body. This way it differentiates between the two body parts. Also notice the sweatshirt in here. Uh, to create the idea of some wrinkles, the students put a black outline around some wrinkles. He's also made two different shades of blue some darker areas and some lighter areas. Here's a lighter shade of blue for the zip of his hoodie. So if you look at it, there's a lot of different shapes here as I click and it highlights everything. So you're basically drawing a series of shapes or puzzle pieces. It's kind of like puzzle pieces and you're putting them together to create an overall image of yourself. Okay? So we're looking for something like this. Now, if you look at my layers palette, the layers palette that you're going to see at the end of this project is going to be really full. I mean, this is really full. If I open up all of these layers, every single line is a different shape, okay? And I thought it was important to show you this because organization of your layers as you work is really, really important in this project. If you don't, you're going to have a lot of layers that are all named path and you're not going to know what anything is. So it's really important to organize yourself as you go. And we're going to be doing that together as I walk you through this tutorial. All right, so now that you know what you're in for, uh, you're also going to be using the pen tool, which is this tool right here, to draw with. And we're going to go over a tutorial for that. Um, and really, the whole point of this project is for you to get used to using the pen tool, to begin using the Pathfinder palette, and to begin to, you know, take color samples and fill in colors. You're going to use a lot of your swatches over here. Your foreground color is this one, and then your outline or your stroke color is that other square right there. So go ahead and open up the next tutorial now that you know what you're in for and we're going to start tracing.